Hello everyone, Regina here with Refuge One Herbal Teacup and More. Just wanting to share a quick tip with you. Y'all, I was followed the other day by this man. I noticed him when I came out my first venue. Noticed him again when I came out of my second venue. Noticed him again when I came out of my third. And then I remembered my defensive driving courses that I took. Aim high, get the big picture, allow yourself a way out. Be aware of your surroundings. Make sure nobody walks up on you out in public. Make sure that nobody's following you either. I'm gonna tell you something. I was very afraid, because this was not a small man. You could tell by his big barrel head. I had indeed become someone's prey. I was so happy that I had gotten my concealed weapons permit. 1776 Tactical is where I went to get my concealed weapons permit. I confessed Jesus Christ as my Lord and my Savior back in 1994. I believe that God can do far more and abundantly than we can ask or think. I believe that he'll keep us from hurt, harm, and, and danger. But I also believe in my concealed weapons permit too. I go nowhere without this girl right here. Get your concealed weapons permit. Consider getting your concealed weapons weapons permit carry legally. It's an eight hour course. They teach you how to abide by the laws of the land, the laws that govern uh, gun ownership. They even teach you how to shoot. It's an extensive course. It's an extensive background check done by your local sheriff's department as well, but it's not as expensive as you think. I have to tell you, even with my weapon with me. I was spooked. I was very afraid. I had become someone's prey. I believe in God, but I also believe that taking extra precaution is essential. So consider getting your concealed weapons permit today. Carry legally. Learn about the laws that govern our lands wherein gun ownership and weapon ownership is concerned. I don't go anywhere without her. Never again.